welcome. This video is going to be a little bit different, as we're going to go over importing videos into Minecraft as several users have requested help with getting files imported. There are two types of Minecraft files, the .mcworld file which works for most people, where you just download it and it works. However, some iOS users have issues importing .mcworld files. And when you try to open it, it shows you that it's a document and it does nothing. For that, you will need to use the .zip file, which a .mcworld file can be renamed to a .zip for this to work, but that is hard to do on a mobile device. So I'm going to try to include the .zip files as well. So once you have a .zip file downloaded, go ahead and tap on it and it should make a folder. This folder you will need to move to your Minecraft games, Mojang, Minecraft Worlds folder. And then when you open up Minecraft, the world should be there. Yep, there we go. So we have successfully imported this world into a mobile device. Some users, when they open up the MC world file, it will give you an import fail. That is due to the file size. To get around this, you need to move the MC world file from wherever it is into your Minecraft worlds folder. Click and hold on the file, select move, and then browse down into your Minecraft game and place it in the worlds folder. And then browse to that location on your phone. and then open the file. And this time, as you've seen, it has imported successfully. So let's go ahead and test the world to make sure it did import successfully on this device. Yep, and here we go. The world has successfully imported on another device without renaming the .mc world file or using a zip. It's just you need to move it to the Minecraft Worlds folder. And this even works for larger files. So let's say you have a 2.5 gigabyte world file and you want to import it. Same thing, you just click on it and you wait for it to import because it is a large file. There we go, successfully imported. Let's go ahead and test out this world. And there you have it. We have successfully imported a 2.5 gigabyte world file on a mobile device. So hopefully you found this tutorial helpful and you're able to now import your games into your mobile devices a little bit easier. The tutorial was on an iOS device, but I've talked with Android users and they were able to do the same steps to fix their issues.
but please leave any comments and suggestions below for future videos. Thanks for watching.